and we're back with another episode of Mountain Blade Warband. And if I don't see, if you guys don't leave a comment, uh, if you guys don't leave comments on the on the on this on this video or the last one, I'm gonna be really super sad. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go jump into a small bucket and see if I can come back to myself into it. I'd be that sad. You guys have no idea. <laughs> Hold on. Somebody just... Ooh. Don't ask. I like watching other YouTubers. I mean, I'm sure that every YouTuber does. No! Hold position! Wait, where'd they go? The serenades have a lot of cavalry. So we have a lot of Kurja cavalry, which means the Serenades are going to get their asses kicked. So it's because our cavalry is better. And our soldiers are better. Their infantry is shit. The Serenades are all around. They're a cool faction, and if you play them right, they can be very fun to play. You can do a lot of stuff with them if you... If you use the units that they are that they have correctly. Their main strong points are cavalry and um, archers. So just have your cavalry fight while um definitely taking a man look. Um veteran footman, yeah. Get a Huskar, I get another Huskar. Scimitar. This sword is a really good sword, so they're um. A lot of times they're very much over a hundred. And people are still screaming. They keep holding their positions, and I don't like it. We're gonna need to advance farther. Well, our cavalry won't, but um, our infantry will. Now that they've charged our um. Now we've reached level twenty-one. I'm trying to dismount my no. Pick up your fucking axe, you asshole. Get off your horse. Now there's nobody for me to kill, because you're fucking stupid.
as you can see, very superior troops. Very superior troop quality. Troop quality. Um, which makes me very happy. So our troops are scattered everywhere, but we're chasing down their men. Oh no, I think we did great. Make sure I have all my weapons. There are two more enemies in the field, it seems like. And we're done. One. So we're going to charge the enemy once more. So now we're going to Headless Horseman, the enemy. Hold on, apparently my family thinks it's okay to keep screaming while I'm recording, as I've asked them not to. Oh. These Mamluks are like knights. They're like Cervadian knights. Except I think they're better. I like them to be better because Fadia is kind of annoying. These guys, um, they're actually like not most Middle Eastern things. They're more like if Europe were Middle Eastern because they have a very The very um big thing with um Ooh, is that what I wanna have? Yes it is. And these are also these cost a lot. As you can see, you can get a good price with these guys. They're basically like if the Japanese were, um... They're basically if the Japanese were... They're basically if the Japanese were in the Middle East, basically, is what I'm trying to say. So I have a little for his flag. Does now I have his flag? No. What about Halmar? Halmar does not. But I can probably get a fishery going in Ichabar. Let's, let's go to the goods merchant. Sell all of this salt. I'm not trying to sell it, I'm trying to, um... What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get bread instead of this stuff. Because, um... This stuff doesn't do as much to party morale as bread does. 
And Brad is like the king of all. Arms merchant. This is said, anything over 100 you want to sell. But you want to make sure you can also um, sell other things too. Ooh. <laughs> ah, that's a pole. No hammers and not pole arms. Can I find anything better than what I have? Four cleaver, 45, 56. I don't know if that's blunt. No, I want a blunt weapon. Um. So this is the armor merchant. Kind of know how to pay for it. I want to buy these badass gauntlets. Yes. Now we're gonna take a walk around the streets and see what we can sell. I'm gonna find the guild master, which is up there, I think. Because I want to get two enterprises going. So, Tanju Noyan, why doesn't he like me? Is it because I don't know him? I don't get to know him. Um, oh, he's prisoner of... Fuck. And we got a Toga. Oh, shit, he doesn't like me. Oh yeah, he doesn't like me because I didn't accept his vassalage. Now I gotta go back and fight the Vagiers again, because they're attacking the homeland. Mathel does reach level 9. I want to soon, if we ever make our own kingdom, to probably take over the Vagiers. Might start with that, because it's more of a defensive position, because we have our allies in the back. I have to find the, um, the, the, um, Khan. Do you have any more tasks for me? So I can just give him the lancers I have now. Fuck you, game. I can just give him the lancers I have now, can I? We have 26 lancers, so... I mean, I can put these guys in the front as, um, fodder. Then we have another veteran, and we have more Huskals. Now we have another warrior. So now I can buy an Enterprise in Tova. So the greatest thing to do is going to be most expensive thing, so I'm going to keep that in mind. As soon as I find the, um... You killed Master? Come on. So no.
How long have I been recording? 15. Okay. But yeah, check out Gamerpire on Twitch. He's a big supporter of mine. He's always... He kind of inspired me to do YouTube, kind of. Because um, he's always been really nice to me. And he's always... He's always been a really nice friend to me. And he's always... He's, he's always known how to... He's always known how to make people laugh, and he's known how to make me laugh. And I think maybe if you go check out him on Twitch... But, um, maybe you'll actually like him. And make sure to donate. Um, it goes to him. But the thing is, even though it goes to him, um, it can help him achieve what he wants to achieve. And maybe he'll do charity soon. Um, but if you want, you can donate to him. Um, for his birthday, when I get enough subscribers, I might do a stream for him. It's like, get like, not too much money, not like charity wise, but like, do like a stream to like, maybe commemorate him and maybe have some of you maybe look at his channel, maybe you'll like him, maybe you'll donate to him. That would be really nice. But um, please do so. Because I know a lot of people would, would enjoy his content, he is fetish. A wine from grapes. What we do each week. Probably no. Uh brewery. Probably eighty no. Tools from iron. Harder than fifty eight, okay, that's where I might go. Well, first off, I want to maybe talk about this productive enterprise a bit more. Maybe 120 a week. A weavery. 32 a week. Yeah, maybe... Flax. 32 a week. I'm thinking of going tools because I don't have enough to pay for dye. Leather from hides. 61 a week. Um, no. F f 88 a week. I'm thinking of going tools. Then. 62 a week. Let me check tools one more time. Because when I look at the die. It's $438 a week. But it's too much, so two small iron. 158, and it's only gonna take. Yeah. And having like three of these will help boost my profit a bit more. Well, wow, where is this girl? Show on that. So it's in Oxcall. Wanted to fight the Swadians, but I don't know if I'm in a position to actually be smart enough. I'm, I don't know if I'm in a smart enough position to fight them at the moment because right now, if you look. Okay, now my um, die work should start. I'm being careful to avoid the towns. And I'm gonna go in between the territory. Oh. Huh? Look, I can win this battle. I know I can. Like, an easy to win battle. Unless he has like 10, that's like all. It depends on all 105 of his men are like knights. Okay, no. We're fine then. Oh, his men at arms.
And now my cavalry will sit on the hill. So the Swadians are witch. I'm mean, rich. Sorry. I'm gonna just start yelling random foods because apparently that's what people expect Swedish people to do. Smalaga storta. Smila. I don't know why I'm still using this as a arm when I change to the axe. I think this is balanced. They're cavalry, so it's really killing us, but... Okay, somebody just texted me. Oh, there's the Swadian Knight. And there's the Count. I think that's the Count. That has to be the Count. Unless he's the one in the Great Helmet. Nope, that's a Man at Arms. Man at Arms, definitely. There is a guy going around in the Great Helm. If I can capture him, that would be amazing. Hmm. Don't know if I want any Rodok units. Do I have any food? They don't have any food. I'm gonna have to buy food soon. So there's that problem. Oh, they're right there. Now I'm gonna go find those bandits. Oh, I picked the wrong option, didn't I? Oh well. Probably desperate men who um, really need the money. We don't know. We don't know the life of a bandit. So... I'm gonna have to go back to Tolga because we accidentally... Mm. Yeah, sure. All you could have did was say, "Hey, can you go free?" Yeah, sure, you can. Just give me like, can you give me like maybe five hundred? Yeah, that's what I would have done. I would have been like, "Hey, can you give me five hundred for this?" Do I mean, you don't, you don't have to. I mean, obviously, but I mean, I want you to be like, I want you to be like sincere that you really want him back, because I don't want him feeling bad. So it's, I'll like just give me five hundred, and I'll make him think that I paid a lot. I mean, did you pay a lot? I'll say, did you pay like 9 million? Make them... Two days. Make them think that like... Oh my god. So I'm gonna do a monologue. So, um... My friend and I... We were, um... We were at like this... We were at Red, Lo we were at Red Lobster. And, um... Because I went to Red Lobster with my friend and I had never been there before. And, um... It was funny, because, um... It was actually very funny, because the waiter was, um... I think he was drunk himself, but he spilled... He spilled, um... Vine? On... My friend's mother. And, um, it was pretty funny. Because, um, 
We kept on joking around saying if we get pulled over, we're gonna say you're drunk. We should say you're drunk. She didn't really say she was mad to the waiter, but she should have because um, it's kind of I wouldn't have like I would have been pissed, you know. Can I find a person in the guildmaster here? Is there a guildmaster here? I don't think there is a guildmaster here. It's rather strange. There has to be. This is the weapons merchant. Wait, how long have we been recording? Okay, we can sit here for a while and, like, find a fucking weapons merchant. I'm sure people wouldn't like me going around an axe. So it's uh, saying he's nearby, but he's really not, and it's kind of annoying me. This is a weaponsmith. Oh, he's right in front of my face the whole time. So we may go break the other guy out of Serenity territory. Okay, so we're nearly on. So we will, I will see you in the next video. And please have a nice day. And please comment. If you don't comment, I'm gonna like, I'm gonna like cry out my asshole. So I will see you guys in the next video.